Hello, Ron Silico here. What I want to talk about in this video today is the importance of writing things down. The late, great basketball coach, uh, one of my particular favorites that I've learned a lot from, not only with character development, leadership, coaching, uh, people, and then specifically basketball, the late, great Don Meyer had three rules. And his rules were everyone says yes, sir, or no, sir, or yes, ma'am, no, ma'am. Everyone picks up trash, which spoke to the concept of we're all equals, we're all in this together, we're all, we all have a responsibility to take care of things. And then the third one was a concept that he talked about all the time that said everyone takes notes. And study after study of successful people, in all walks of life, a common trait is that people in those positions or the success that describes those people is that they take great notes. There's not an assumption that I'll remember it. I don't need to write it down. People take great notes. And if you look at really successful people, odds are they they have a journal with them. They're using a, a note-taking device on something electronic, whether it's a laptop, iPad, smartphone, etc. But there's a common theme that everyone takes notes. And then there's another differentiator. So I, I'd, say there's, I'd say there's three differentiators. There's people that don't take notes. And the message that this conveys is that is one that I can remember everything. This topic area is not that important to me, or it conveys a message of perhaps arrogance and ego saying, there's really nothing I can learn from this person. The more you take notes, the more you observe, the more you remember, and the more you write things down, you get better and better at it. So I'd say there's three differentiators. And the first one is people just don't take notes at all. They try and remember everything and inevitably gaps occur. There's only a small percentage of people that have photographic memories that can rem remember everything. Uh, the second differentiator that I would say are people that write everything down, but there's not a centralized storage system. And I'm not saying there needs to be a centralized storage system that's used every single time you take a note, but it's a situation where any piece of paper that's found, a napkin, again, the smartphone, the, the notes are taken and they're great and they're very useful, but then they're not stored and then inevitably there's some loss that occurs. Uh, I definitely f float between this one and the third differentiator, which is people that take copious, detailed, great notes about observations, things they've learned, ideas, and then put them into a centralized system such as Evernote, Google File, or something on their computer that enables them to capture all that. So the three differentiators in my mind are people that don't take notes, uh, people that do take notes, but it's in a very haphazard fashion and there's no attempt at centrali centralizing the organization. And then the third part is organizing everything in a centralized manner. Uh, with codes, file names, indexes, references, and keywords that can help you find the information at a moment's notice. To help you be successful and help you remember things in life, adopt the Don Meyer philosophy of everyone taking notes. It's a great way to log what you've learned. For example, how many of us have had great ideas when we're just laying in bed at night or we're in the shower or we've got that quiet moment where we're on a hike but we've got no way to capture that great idea and then we end up losing it. It could have been a million dollar idea. It could have been an idea that changes your life for the better in terms of relationships or something else but you just weren't able to capture it. You need to be able to capture ideas at a moment's notice. Everyone takes notes and then put it into a centralized file system continue to develop that process. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.